Lots of news coming out of Seiko this week. Today we saw the release of the Seiko 5 GMT. Today we also see the release of the brand new Arnie watch inspired by a watch worn by Arnold Schwarzenegger. Today we get three different versions of that watch, all solar powered, analog, digital. Let's take a look at some of the details. Today Seiko have announced the return of the analog digital Arnie. In the Seiko Prospects C lineup of watches, there will be three different versions, three new watches with 200 meters of water resistance and solar movements, and that movement is the H855. As I mentioned, three different versions. So the first version is the SNJ033. This is a stainless steel version on a stainless steel bracelet. It gets a black dial with red and blue accents on the pushers. So it's not the pushers themselves, they sort of get a ring of paint between the pushers and the pusher guards. Then there's a second version that is the SNJ035. That is a black PVD coated and stainless steel mixture. So that shroud is in a stainless steel that is PVD coated. And then the lugs are in stainless steel uncoated. There is a black dial on this. It gets a rubber strap. This gets black and blue accents on those pushers. And then you get a little bit of a blue accent on the minute hand and then a blue accent in the bezel for the first 15 minutes. So some blue accents on the dial and on the bezel looks very good. Last but not least is a limited edition. This is the SNJ037. This is an all black version. So you're getting that shroud in black. Also the case itself is in black. You're getting a black PVD coated bracelet as well. So this is the all black version. This gets red accents. So you're getting a red and blue accent on the pushers on this. And then you're getting a red seconds hand on that dial. Uh, looks very, very good. Pops really nicely. This one is limited to 4,000 pieces. So specs here, the specs on this watch are going to be large because this is a large watch, 47 millimeters. So this is a 47 millimeter watch, 50.9 millimeter lug to lug thickness, 14.2 millimeters. 200 meters of water resistance. All of these get hard lex crystals. All of them get Luma bright on the indices and hands. You get an LED backlight for that LED down at the six o'clock position. Full calendar, alarm, power reserve, all that good stuff gets packed into that H855 movement, solar powered movement. So it is powered by any light. Any light source can power this watch. These are coming in at around seven to $800, depending on the version that you are getting that fully PVD coated limited edition version on a bracelet is on the more higher end of that scale, while the version that is on the rubber strap is on the lower end of this scale. So around that $800 range, seven to $800 range is expensive considering that you're getting a hard Lex. I have to say that. I pretty much say that with almost every single video that I do for Seiko these days. They continue to provide watches with hard Lex crystals in this seven to $800 range. And I think at this range, you should have a Sapphire crystal which is more scratch resistant. And again, a lot of people argue with me in the comments down below. Check out my video where I actually tested in a real world test scenario, hard Lex versus Sapphire versus a uh, standard mineral crystal and the Sapphire crystal wins out in every single category. Anyway, really awesome watches, big functional tool watches, lots of pushers, looks really good. Uh, and obviously made famous by Arnold Schwarzenegger. Very cool watch, very large watch. He's a big guy, so it definitely does make sense. Tell me what you guys think down in the comments below. I wanna hear from you guys. What do you think of these watches? Please also don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that bell icon. It is super helpful for the channel and I very much appreciate it. Please follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is watchchrisblog, all one word. I have some links in the description. Those links are to Amazon. If you click those links and buy anything, it helps support the channel. It doesn't cost you anything extra. However, I very much appreciate it. Anyway, thank you for logging on. I'll catch you guys in the next video.